In this video, I'll show you how to download and install the free ebook software Calibre on a Linux computer. Just go ahead and search for Calibre. It's spelled this way. I'll include the link in the description of this video. And this is the link we want here. So it's calibre-ebook.com. And we'll just click on Downloads. So you can choose the whatever you have. If you have 64-bit Windows, you do this one. And check out my other video showing how to do that. This shows how to download it generically on Linux. It's just a binary. Uh, and so we can just select all of this and right click and go copy and then we can paste this in our terminal so we right click and go paste or you can do control shift V to paste this and then you hit the return key I'm going to install it a different way but what this command is doing this is just showing us we get into super user we're going to do wget and we download the actual installer which is right here and then we just install we just execute that uh, installer that sh file and to install this on our system and then it will appear in our installed applications when we left click in the bottom right uh, bottom left hand corner I'm using Linux Mint the, an easier way to do this is to open up the software manager you can just left click in the bottom left hand corner and start typing in software manager and then you can just search for caliber and then I would recommend choosing this flat hub version because it'll be a later version I believe this is a version 4.9 whereas the other version is an older version a 3.x version then just left click install in the top right hand corner and this will automatically download it and and manage the installation you can remove it easily so if you're not as comfortable using the command line this might be the way that you want to go and while this is downloading and installing I'll talk quickly about caliber it's ebook software that helps you manage your ebook collection you can download ebooks you can download news and connect it to your uh, tablet or your Kindle or your e-reader or your phone and then you can read those ebooks uh, on your device. You can also just read them within Calibre, within the software on your computer. So it's a good desktop e reader as well. And you can also use this software to create your own ebooks. You can use it to convert ebooks from one format to another. You can edit the metadata of your ebook. So it's a really, really cool software and it's 100% completely free and open source, the free full version. If you like this software and find it useful, um, consider here on the website, you can learn how to support and get involved. So you can donate, uh, you can support the development of Calibre, and you can also help with um, language translations and bug reporting and developing this software. It's just open, free open source software developed uh, for the community. So really, really cool project. Okay, this is done installing now. We can just click launch from the software manager. We can also get to this program anytime uh, just by left clicking in the bottom left hand corner and start typing in Calibre. We'll find it from our installed programs list. When you first open it up, we're just going to choose our installed language, our language that we want to use, which is English. And then we're going to choose where we want this to be on our computer. I'd recommend leaving this uh, by default, but you can put it in a specific directory if you want. And then you want to choose what e-reader you have. So if you're just using your phone, you maybe have an Android phone like me, you can choose uh, the Android phone or tablet. If you're not sure, if you can't find the specific device that you have, um, you can just go ahead and click generic and just use a generic e-ink device. That's what I'm going to do right now. And here we go. Go ahead and finish. And this opens up and this is what it looks like. So go ahead and check out the next video and we'll get started exploring this interface and learn how to use Calibre.